What is up you guys, my name is Kyle aka Kinger and welcome to my world. So major late start to the vlog today, like major late start. It is 10 o'clock p.m. So I just got back from work at like 9. Uh, literally worked straight through. I worked from 11.30 until 9, 9, 9.30, something like that. Yeah, almost a 10 hour shift, so yeah. And um, I am exhausted, <laughs> but I still have to go to the gym. But right when I got home, I ate turkey burgers, so I'm letting my food settle a little bit because I don't like going to the gym right after I eat because it's like going and swimming right after you eat. It's not good. So, um, and my allergies are killing me again. So I need to go and actually get some stuff for that. Um, one of my customers today mentioned... Um, flow flow nasal or nasal flow something like that so I'm gonna go look into that because my allergies have been absolutely terrible lately so this morning they were like god-awful so it's not something that anybody should ever have to endure so uh, yeah anyways I worked for like a 10-hour shift made pretty good money for a Thursday I was actually surprised but I have to basically wake up and do it all over again tomorrow and I might have to stay even later tomorrow because usually I get cut early on Fridays because there's more servers on, but if I get cut early, then I don't make any money. And because I don't work on Saturday, I like to stay later on Fridays so I can make as much money as possible. But that also cuts into me being able to go to the gym. So if I stay late and make more money, like, yeah, that's more important, but I can still go to the gym on Saturday to make up for missing Friday if I do so miss Friday. So, but right now, I do need to go to the gym, or get ready to go. I'm still letting my food settle a little bit more. But, um, today is leg day, which sucks because my legs were on fire at work today. I don't know why. I think the elliptical, um, at the gym really hits, like, my quads and all that stuff, and that was what was on fire today. So, um, yeah. I'm not looking forward to doing leg day today. Because tomorrow I'm going to be more sore, and tomorrow is like our busiest day of the week, Friday. So, oh my god. The grind does not stop. Ever. Ever, ever, ever. <laughs> so, I'm going to get ready for the gym. It's going to be a, definitely a short vlog today, today so I uh, apologize for that. But Saturday is going to be a lot of fun. We should uh, definitely be doing a lot being that we're celebrating my grandpa's birthday. I do have to film a video, and I th a main channel video. I think we're going to do it on Saturday, because I think that's when everybody's schedule's linked up. So it's definitely going to be a busy day. And then the next day after that, on Sunday, I have to work another double. So it's been a crazy week. So I'm going to get ready for the gym, and then I will talk to you guys right before I go to the gym. So see you in a second. All right, guys, I am all set to go to the gym. It's leg day, one of my most hated days, but we gotta get it, so let's get it. What's up guys, so I just got back from the gym. Holy crap, I sweated my butt off today, I don't know what it was, I was like drenched in sweat. Uh, going on the, uh, what was that, um, I just started running for my mile, in the like, beginning of my cardio, I was just drenched. <laughs> so, um, definitely got a good workout and good leg day in. And, um, yeah, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. So tomorrow is going to be a different story. When I'm walking around all over the place for, like, eight hours on my feet all day, I'm going to be dying. But, you know, for now I'm okay. <laughs> so I tell you what, getting back in the gym this time was not only, like, one of the best decisions I could have ever made, but I know, like, truly know this time. Like, because I've struggled with weight loss for years and years and years. I have become a very, very lazy individual. And what's cool about that is, well, not cool about it, I guess, but is the fact that I've accepted that and have realized that I really let my, not really let myself go, but I gained some weight coming down from Florida too. And back in, back last year or two years ago now, when me and uh, my best friend Eric started working out, we were going hard for two months straight. Uh, January and February, the beginning of the year, right after New Year's, we just went ham, and I was down to 195, I believe, and I could have, I never did a pull-up in my entire life, ever, 
ever until that point. And I, by the time I left the gym, we stopped going at the end of February or like beginning of March. I could do 10, I think, if not more than that, before I left. I could do 10. I've never been able to do a single pull-up in my life. So when I stopped going, um, we had some things happen with a friend that uh, it, it just made us get down the dumps. And um, we just stopped going to the gym. So ever since that point, I never really got back into the gym. I tried a few times, but just never worked out. So this time, though, with seeing how FouseyTube, who is like my biggest inspiration, FouseyTube and Roman Atwood are like my biggest YouTube inspirations, and seeing the results that Fousey has, granted, he has a better ways of losing weight than I do as far as his meal plans and the workout plans and everything. He knows probably a lot more than I do about working out at the gym. But just seeing his results is so motivating. And it's like in not even 90 days, he's lost his belly. He's back to being shredded. Like, it's just, it's insane. And all he's been doing is literally eating healthy and working out. That's it. Taking protein and, and whatever. But I'm not even taking protein yet because I still got to save up and buy some. That shit's expensive. That's like $50 for a big bottle of protein. I get sent the six because it's like really clean and just really good. It tastes really good. So, I mean, he's just getting ripped, and it's so inspiring. And that really got me this time where I'm just like, you know what? I'm about to be 22 this year in September. I was like, I really need to start getting healthy. I've struggled for so many years. I haven't been fit since I was a little kid as far as even being thin. I've always had, like, a little bit of fat on my stomach, and it's always been uh, something I was self-conscious about. I never – this is why I don't really go to the beach much. I don't take my shirt off. I'm very, very embarrassed by it. And I know I'm not the fattest dude in the world. I get that. All my friends say that all the time. But what they don't understand is it's still embarrassing nonetheless. I don't want fat on me. It's embarrassing to me. So that's why I don't go to the beach much. You know, I don't really go and, and do all kinds of stuff that involves taking my shirt off, I guess, because I'm just embarrassed. So, and, you know, when I hang out with all my friends, all their those guys are, like, shredded. So as far as, like, abs and everything, so they don't care. They take their shirts off, and I'm the only one that doesn't have my shirt on or shirt off. So, I don't know. Just so many things have led me to just be like, you know what, dude? You got to get healthy. You need to, this is what you need to do. So, that is what I started doing. And I feel a million times better. Granted, like yesterday, I was just purely exhausted. But, I mean, when you go that hard and you're, my body's not used to doing that um, all this time. And I go and do that. They're like, body's like, what the hell are you doing? You haven't done this shit in years. You need to calm down. <laughs> no, no time to calm down. So, I mean, I just like, I guess I got somewhat take it easy, but, you know, I got to get shit done. And uh, I'm trying to lose as much as I can in these 90 days. Now, I know the 90 days isn't just it. Like, oh, I, I do the 90 days and I'm done. No, I understand that I, I got to keep going. But I want to see how much I can lose. Fousey Tubes almost lost 30 pounds in not even the full 90 days. In, like, about 50 days, he already lost almost 30, 30 pounds. So that's just insane to me. And it's very, very inspiring. So, you know, I just finally got to that point where I'm like, okay, you know, you really got to get shit done. You got to really stick to it this time, eat healthy and do everything. And one thing that I always struggled about doing was eating healthy. Now, you know, every day I eat healthy. I might have, you know, and I have a major sweet tooth. I love sweets. I love ice cream. I love cakes. I love all that good stuff. Everybody does. And something I've been able to do since I started is have one of those a week. I was going to like, you know, try and do it every couple days or whatever because I like I said I have a sweet tooth but I went a whole the first week I went the whole week without having anything the first time I had something even remotely sweet was the 4th of July when I had that piece of apple pie and it was a tiny piece of apple pie then on Monday I had the cookie thing that that cookie skillet thing at Chili's oh my god I can't resist it every time I go there and that's been my dessert the whole time and then today I'm not gonna lie to myself I did have I have these left over and I literally keep these right here in my room as like temptation but I don't do it today I finally had one and I looked at it they're 160 calories six grams of fat 26 carbs 18 sugars and they have a gram of protein <laughs> Gary protein <laughs> um, but you know they're not that bad I literally burnt that off like the instant I got to the gym so I mean yes it doesn't help but I mean 
I'm, I'm doing pretty good with, you know, some people think they can cut cold turkey sweets and stuff, and some can, like very few. It's hard to do that when you're used to it all the time. You're used to eating something all the time like that. So I think I've done pretty well. I've been almost at this for two weeks now, and I've had literally the apple pie, the skillet cookie, and one of those cake things in almost two weeks. That's crazy for me. So I feel like I'm already doing really good with that. Um, I don't drink any pop anymore. Uh, the first pop I had was at Chili's. I had a few Coca-Colas. And then um, I had a, a little bit at work, but nothing crazy. I usually drink water at work or like I make an Arnold Palmer. So, and then I drink Arnold Palmers, which they do have a lot of sugar. So that's not good. But I mean, I'm doing good for, you know, not cutting cold turkey because that'd be pretty hard for me. So I'm like, you know, weaning off of it, you know. So again, I'm rambling. One of my... Uh, one of the people that commented, uh, Abigail, she always says that I'm not rambling, I'm just talking, which I am. I am talking to you guys because I don't talk to anybody. So, um, you guys are who I talk to. So, I guess it's not rambling, but I feel it's rambling. So, oh. So, yeah. Um, something I needed to do too. I don't know if I'm, I don't think I'm going to do it in this vlog. I might do it tomorrow. I need to do it when I have more time. But, um, some buddy or Abigail actually I think it was too wanted to see Tucker she asked if I've had Tucker since he was a pup and I have so that gave me the idea to show you guys some pictures of Tucker when he was a pup uh tonight I don't have the time to do that as far as editing the vlog and everything so um I'm gonna do that on a day where I have more time because you guys gotta see him he is cute full of wrinkles because he had too much like excess skin because he wasn't grown into it he just missed wrinkles man and it's so cute so I'll show you guys that in a future vlog. Um, we are almost still to 200 subscribers. We were up to where we only needed 14 more. We were at 186, and then we dropped back down to 185. So got to get to 200 subscribers, and I'll do my first q and Not doing it until you guys get to 200 subs. So we're going to do that. I am filming the main channel video on Saturday, hopefully with my friends. And yeah, that's what I got going on right now. I honestly think um, the next day off that I have is Saturday, which is going to be a busy day, but I do want to kind of record more Batman Arkham Knight. And if people watch it, they watch it. And I'm going to make them shorter. I'm going to try and make them like 15 minutes. But I haven't played the game since. I uploaded part three, and I really want to play the game. But I, I feel like ever since I started recording gameplays, I can only play the game if I'm recording. So... I guess it's just it's just weird. I'm just used to it, I guess. So I'm going to try that out and just see. If people watch it, they watch it. If they don't, they don't. But it's just more experience for me and all that stuff. And it's fun for me, regardless if people are watching, I guess. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. Main channel video Saturday. That'll be up next week. Um, let's see. I think that's all I have to talk about, actually. I have another double tomorrow, so tomorrow's going to be difficult. I'm going to vlog, but it's probably going to be really short because I'm probably realistically going to get out at like 10, maybe midnight even, or so. I might not even be able to go to the gym tomorrow, and I'm going to have to do everything on Saturday. So if there is a vlog tomorrow, it's probably going to be short. So just letting you guys know that now. But hope you guys at least enjoyed this vlog. I tried making it. It's just another one of me rambling or talking, whatever you want to call it. So, yeah. I'm going to try and make them more exciting. Uh, being that I work all the time, it is hard, honestly, to go out and do stuff. But uh, pretty soon we're going to be able to go out and do more. I'm slowly stacking money again. Uh, I got to pay bills and do all the grown-up stuff. But once I get more money, <coughs> excuse me, I'm going to try and go out and do stuff. I definitely want to get a GoPro for you guys because I want to go to, it's called Rainbow River. Or we can go to Wikiwachi River too. And uh, show you guys, it's all spring-fed water, so it's crystal clear. And we go tubing down there. So I think that would be a really cool vlog. We need to do that. And um, maybe go to Bush Gardens one day. We literally are 20 to 25 minutes away from Bush Gardens. So I can get a bunch of our my friends and stuff. We can go do that too. And I can film with just this camera. I almost dropped it. That was awkward and sketchy. So anyways, I'm done talking. Holy crap. It's, I've talked for 11 minutes. Jesus Christ. So I am going to go shower because I stank. And I need to shave, do all that good stuff. Edit the vlog, go to sleep, wake up, do all this shit all over again. <sighs> I'm not ready for work tomorrow. So, yippee skippy. If you guys enjoyed this video, though, please leave a like. Helps me out. Leave a comment. 
share this video with your friends if you can. Spread the word about my channel. Let's get to 200 subscribers. We need 15 more people. That's not that much. Just share it on your Facebook page. And if people like it, they like it and they'll check it out. And they'll subscribe. So 15 people. Let's get there. And I'll fill my first Q&A. And if you are watching this and haven't subscribed already, subscribe. I would appreciate it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for another daily vlog. Hope you guys have a great day. Boy.